прозрачен воздух на закате над городом моим. Вечерним звоном ветер плачет мечтой веков таблин. И камни дремлют, и деревья безмолвие. Сердечной раной разделения живет тоскуя боль. Иерусалим, Иерусалим, объятый светом золотым, тебе в основу песня. Find the main road of the city, but we dug a little bit to the side of it, and one day suddenly the debris opened to the side. And this is one of these surprises that you enter and suddenly you see, you will see what we see. A very adventurous uh, path going underground. The main goal of these excavations was to expose Jerusalem's main road. This was a bonus. With 70 yards of channel exposed, Reich and his colleagues haven't used their shovels even once. It's all as we see it now. You can feel history in your bones when you're walking inside a structure like this. You're looking at the stones from each side. As you can see, there's 20 centimeters above me, so you can walk very easily. And this was done 2,000 years ago. This is the main sewer, the main gutter, which accumulates the rainwater from the winter rains and diverts it from the entire city, including the Temple Mount, to the Pool of Siloam, which is about 200 meters away from us in the south. 
In ancient times, many city dwellers under Roman rule enjoyed a drainage system just like the one found in Jerusalem. It provided them with cleaner, healthier living conditions. But in the first century, when the Roman army arrived to subdue the Jewish revolt, many of the local residents found another use for it. The people in those days used these sewer systems to hide inside and to flee from the city. 